what's good youtube it's your boy invader and we are back again with another video man it is, i just dropped my freaking controller what are we talking about it is early in the morning literally 9 a.m here and i get on twitter and i see that 2k dropped another patch today uh, basically i guess getting ready for season two and in this patch my friend angel my guy bro he be hooking me up with the stuff letting me know what's going on he tells me there's a new quest called rebirth and basically we're about to see it now so without let's go figure out what that is all right so you gotta go to atm all right he's talking let's actually see what he says oh he don't say anything okay play 10 3v3 or 2v2 games in the city at 90 overall or above to unlock rebirth with rebirth all new my player builds start with 30 with up to 30 of your total badge points already earned plus your starting attribute count increases from 85 to 90. all right so normally for me i would be like hey this don't even really matter because i already got bills but what's crazy though is 30 of your total badge points is kind of insane to start with um and it makes life a lot easier what if i decided to make a small guy and i wanted to put 30 of my badge points already on my shooting because we all know that playmaking is very very easy to use that's like that's that that takes little to no time to get so if i wanted to make a small guard i can now put those 30 badges on the mismatch if that's how it works we'll have to look into it to see how exactly it works but if that's how it works then that's insane uh what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna come back after i play 10 games so we can look at it and figure out exactly how it works i've also been told that the walk back animation the moonwalk is actually gone now so i'm actually gonna head over to the program real quick and see if this is fire facts or if this is wrong let's actually take a look see and figure out if it has indeed been taken out of the game there is no patch notes at the moment i'm sure 2k will probably drop them a little bit later as of now like i said um this uh uh just came out the patch just came out so let's see what happens when we go in here all right so we're in the program the hyperbolic time chamber oh my god in my eye all right let's figure out if this works oh it's gone no the walk back animation it's gone you can't do it anymore yeah you can't do it anymore yeah you that is that is a move they do not want you doing moonwalk is gone you cannot do that move anymore holy moly it's gone wow yep that's crazy you can't do it anymore and trust i know how to do it i just made a whole video on it yeah you literally yeah you can't do it he does this now that wall back animation is gone um all right well there you go i don't know what else has been changed but if there is anything else that's been changed i will let you guys know oh i'm gonna go check now about the uh rebirth and go see how that works now so all right, so I started doing some thinking and I was like, why would I play 10 games right now when I can just go to YouTube and I'm sure somebody's already got the 10 games done and just rip it from there. So that's what I decided to do. Shout out to this man, Marman here. I'm going to have his link to his channel in the description. If you guys want to go subscribe to him, but he finished the 10 games that's required to get rebirth. And basically what it does is it gives you eight shooting badges. It gives you eight uh, playmaking badges. It gives you eight defensive badges as well as eight uh finishing oh no seven defensive badges as well as seven finishing badges so that brings you to 30 i believe also there's a change in there where you also get um plus five badge count instead of it being plus one i don't know if that's a it was that was a glitch in his video or what it was but he had an extra plus five that he could put on um off rip and that didn't even that was without him even doing the college games or anything like that so he was able that means you would get another plus four which will bring te technically you to nine so let's say you went to if it is plus five let's say you go to uh villanova which allows you to get your plus four shooting that means you could potentially start off with 17 shooting badges if it is actually plus five right now of course i can't verify that because i haven't done the 10 badges yet but you guys saw in the video that's what it shows there so even starting with 17 shooting badges for a small build or any build because shooting badges are clearly the things that take the longest to get is not a bad start 
obviously only having to play the uh, college games, you can get that in and out very, very quickly. Uh, it's pretty easy to win in there, especially if you have a uh, really high shooting, you just score really easy. It's about an hour and you'd have 17 uh, shooting badges done in about an hour, maybe an hour and a half already right there. So that's not bad. And you'd be 90 overall. So your, your attributes wouldn't be butt cheeks that butt cheeks. It'd be pretty good for the most part. Um, and you just be able to play the game. So again, shout out to Marmar. He showed how it worked. Uh, also, it looks like you get the ability to change your takeover off rip as well. You don't need Mamba mentality. Don't know if that's a glitch or not. Uh, but yeah, that is one that looks like it happens as well. So that's going to be it for this video. I do think it's a W. Also, you guys can go ahead and uh, you can do this anytime you create a new build. So this is going to absolutely make 2K some more money. But if you guys enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, leave a sub, leave a comment and let me know if you think this is a W as far as the rebirth method. Let me know if you think it's a W that the wild back is gone or if you think uh, that cheese still should have been there. Outside of that, catch you guys in the next video. We're out. Peace.